Hello everybody, welcome back to another video at the Comics Den. As you can see, it is a very rainy day out today. Me and Sarah are on our way right now to go check out a comic book collection. We're going to be going to Brian's house. He told me he's got a bunch of different Marvel comics for us to look at today. Some cool first appearances, minor key issues. It should be a really fun time. It's a little bit of a storm over here in Florida, so we're going to pick up comics in the rain. Not the best idea. <laughs> Probably about 20 minutes away, so we should be there pretty soon. Excited to check out the collection, but we're chugging through the storm. We're getting stuck together for the convention coming up soon we have a bunch of different conventions planned we have nerdy con next month which we're gonna be live streaming at should be really fun Tom's convention at the beginning of January I think it's when is that again the 15th. January 15th is when Tom's convention is we have two tables we're gonna be setting up at for Tom's convention so it should be a really fun time it's the first time we're ever really setting up at like a big con we're planning on doing our own little small like garage sale style convention we've done one before a long time ago Ago, but we plan on doing another one that might be in the next like month or two so that should be pretty fun so these collections that are coming in are nice inventory for all these like conventions and small sales we plan on doing we usually sell everything strictly online but I think we're gonna start obviously doing more shows and stuff and getting out there more all right so everybody we will bring you back once we get to Brian's house hopefully it, it stops raining a little bit but I don't think we're gonna get so lucky <laughs> Really out Windy here. out here. So today's video, we did have DIY OJ. They sent us this awesome jersey. They are a great company. They do all sorts of customized jerseys. So we got it customized with the comic den. We got our little logo on here. And then I put 21 because that's the year that we started. So we'll have all their information in the description down below. Make sure you go check them out and use our code DEN10 to get a nice discount. Brian just opened the door. How are you? All right, so we're here with Brian. Big oh, collection. Man. Yeah, so I got you early Fantastic Four over there, Daredevil. Then I got you some yeah, newer to Daredevil. Then I got you some the uh, Jim Lee run on Fantastic Four. Yeah, it's the Jim Lee run. You always have the such picture? like the stuff everybody's always looking for. Yeah, right. I always try, I always try to bring in what next movie's coming up. Yeah. Oh. So when I go home and I start digging in the crates and everything, I'm like, okay, well, I know Black Panther's coming up. Okay. They released. They said they're gonna do the Nova special on Disney Plus. So yeah. I brought you Nova one and two. I know nice Venom story. three is coming out. So I brought these are all the miniseries from Venom. Oh, awesome. Lethal Protector, Final uh, Funeral Prior, The Mace. Um, oh wow. So we got two first appearance of War Machine. Oh, there's two of them. Yeah, yeah. So I got keys and I got multiple copies of the keys. Oh, oh that's awesome. Wow. And then you got War Machine 283. Yes, yeah, so that's the second one, yeah. So that's the first cover appearance of the War Machine armor. That's awesome. Then that's the second one. These Daredevils are nice too. Yeah, And the yeah, Fantastic yeah. Fours. Yeah, you got early issue 35. Oh, those are great. You got 185, 186. Like yeah, these are some great Daredevils. Love that one, Black Widow. A nice stack here, Pariah. This is a whole stack of Daredevil? Yeah, a whole stack of Daredevil. Oh, there you go, oh, our first, first nuke. nuke. Right yeah, I love that nice Oh, one. duplicates of great. number one, yeah. So yeah, I, I try to bring you multiple copies of the keys. Great Punisher cover with Daredevil. Yeah, this is a very nice Daredevil run. Yeah, this yeah. is really nice. We got 183. 106, 204. Oh, scrolls cover. Spider Man on 207. Oh, yeah, these are great. 208, 216. There's about how many books here? There's a bunch here. It's 800. Oh, you that's a cool one. 25th anniversary. anniversary duplicate. Mm -hmm. His first solo series, right? Yeah. Okay, this is nice consecutive issues. And then we got the X Men 2099. Uncanny X Men. Then I have some classic X Men. Then I have the Cable Run. X Factor. Is the first um, domino in there? Oh, uh, dog is on the way. <laughs> Morning. <laughs> there you That's go, 11. Oh yeah, you got one, two issues. Very cool. Some classic X-Men. Yeah, you got number one. Items covers. I love that Rob Liefeld cover. I mm -hmm. love this run on X Factor. Then I have a number of the uh, mini series, the Gambit. Oh yeah, the mini Gambit mini series. That uh, Gambit number one is cool. Everyone always loves that one. Yeah, yeah and I got, I got a couple copies of the number one for you. Oh, I got cool. three, actually three copies of the number. Oh one. wow, oh, three nice. copies. Uh, that was a one off, and then that's his first mini series. Oh yeah, the die cut. Uh huh. Then I had a Bishop. He had a uh, four part mini series. Have a couple of the number ones. Uh, this was Apocalypse. Uh, origin story, Rise of Apocalypse. That's all the mini series for Venom. Lethal Go through that really quickly. Yeah. So that's the whole Lethal Protector set, couple duplicates. That's a very nice run. Yeah, that's the, the first female sim symbiote. Mm -hmm. You got five, it's Spidey. And the center takes all serials. Oh, there oh, you go. Female nice. Yeah, yeah first, first female, female Venom. Venom. 
Lots forgot nice that one, one was in there, yeah. I know, me too. I forgot it was in that run. It's a pretty nice copy, too. I always love that cover. And I think if you have this full set, I think one of these covers is worth that one right yeah, there. That one's sick. Oh, and then Funeral Fire number oh, one. Oh, one number one. I always love the fish yeah. scale <laughs> yeah. texture to that. And that was the Mace. We have the last Mace series. Oh, mm. yeah, the embossed cover. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, that one's fun. The Madness. Yeah, yeah, the Madness is fun, too. Yeah, this is a really nice Black Panther run. I think number one is the first prince of the Dora Milaje. One or two more loads of Marvel, mm -hmm. then we'll get into DC and Image. Do you have any Spawn? I think I asked yeah, you that. Yeah, I, I, yeah. Oh. I, 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 it's a matter of now I'm able to get everything in one room. Mm -hmm. So now everything's in one room. So I have to... It's a whole process. Whenever I land in Chicago, it's like, okay, let me get try to get stuff organized because mm -hmm. I try to bring you all of one title. But I still have like one or two more boxes of X-Men. I have a lot of image. I was really big into image because I, I love their art style. Oh, Stories yeah. were terrible, but <laughs> the art was great. Great collection for sure. And the Uncanny X-Men. Yeah, and that's that John Romita um, yeah. run on Uncanny X-Men. So yeah. The hologram yeah, the cover. Yeah, hologram covers. And it's cool that there's some duplicates too. Yeah, yeah, yeah that was in my father's collection, in my collection, yeah. we put it together. We're gonna pack this up in the car real quickly, so let me go grab the boxes. Yeah, but definitely some great books in here, a few keys, a few duplicates. This Fantastic Four is nice too. I wasn't a big Fantastic Four. I don't think a lot of people are. Oh yeah, early Fantastic Four there. And this is a Daredevil 28. But you see, he has a lot of damage on that spine. Yeah. And then around that area. So I was like, nah, I don't want to get this to him. I don't want to give you any jump. I'm just saying, if it was worth for you, you could take him. Oh, just take him? Take him. Take him. If, if you can do something with him and you can make some money off of him. Oh, thank you, Brian. Enjoy. Yeah, yeah. Really cool. early Fantastic Four. No problem, Angelo. Thank you so much. Oh, good to see you. Yeah, have fun at Black Panther. Yeah, you, will do. See you. All right, everybody. So this is the last stack of the books. We're going to head on out of here. It's raining really bad outside right now, so we're probably going to turn the camera on once we get back to the house and organize the collection a little bit. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to comment down below and let us know what you think. Angelo's getting all the boxes. Yes. Luckily, it stopped raining a little. But yeah, it stopped raining. The house is a little bit of a mess right now, but we're kind of in the process of moving and then also organizing for all the upcoming shows. So I have everything kind of sectioned off in piles. This is everything that has to be rebagged and boarded. We're probably gonna run the majority of this on whatnot. This is a lot of our like $1.50 inventory. And then over here is a lot of the sets that we have. Box number one. So what I'm gonna do is go through these and pretty much just pull out all the books I kind of want to keep, all the key issues and stuff. We have number one and then number six. So I'll probably hold on to number one. So this I'm going to keep, but what I'll do is I'm going to sell the duplicates. So I have one through six here and then it jumps to eight. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to, I'm going to put the classic X-Men number one with the War Machine and we'll keep that. All right, this Venom set right here is really nice. You got the Mace number one through three complete set. Definitely going to be keeping that. We got the Funeral Pyre one through three. And then this is another nice one here too. The Venom and Carnage. That's a sick cover. And then you got the Madness one through three. Lots of duplicates. That's a killer one right there. We also got the She Venom up there, so now we got two. Two copies of this now, so that's pretty cool. The whole Lethal Protector set, some duplicates on that, and then number one. Probably gonna keep all these Venoms for now. Oh, here we go, we got the War yeah, Machines. Just found them. Definitely gonna be adding these to the keep stack. And then there is 283. So you have Black Panther one. You have two. Yeah, these are nice. I think this might be a little bit of a key on issue four. And then it goes issue six, missing issue five, and then seven. So definitely gonna hold on to all those. All right, so what I'm gonna do with these, oh, that one's actually got a Deadpool card. Oh, nice. That's pretty cool. I'm gonna keep the number twos, early appearance of Deadpool. These two right here, the issue 11s. We'll put those right there. Then these are great covers too. Yeah, with cable, those are fun. I might hold on to those. That one we'll hold on to. That's issue 35. Yeah, nice early Daredevil. First nuke. And these are great Frank Miller issues. Loading up the short box with all the books that we're gonna rebag and board first. Yeah, I got some really great stuff here so far. Oh, oh yeah, those were nice. Three of them. Yeah, there's three Gambit number ones from the miniseries. Oh, wow. So you have one, you have two, and three. That's pretty cool. Hold on to that. Nice pickup. The keys were nice, you know, the Venom keys and stuff, the Iron Man. But definitely a nice filler collection for sure. No no home runs. Put down below what you would have paid for the collection and what you thought of everything that we got. Hope everyone enjoyed the video. Make sure you give it a thumbs up and comment down below and we'll see you next time. Bye everyone.